Hello everyone and welcome to a completely uh, random dress of the live video that I completely forgot I was doing today. So the game has updated and it is 3am. So maybe we should actually be a little bit quiet. <laughs> um, so I am playing with, uh, I thought everyone would say thanks to David and Pro C uh, for setting this up because the game just updated and there is a completely new um, raid boss. We we had uh, Morton Rex. I think it was Morton Rex. Yeah, Morton Rex retired. So no more of that, which in my head is kind of good in a way because it shows that we're not going to be getting like a level above Apex, if you know what I mean. Because if they kept that going, um, I, well, for me anyway, I'd kind of stop doing the raids and um, I was like, oh, uh... I've got level 30 more Rex, I don't want to keep on doing it because... Uh, so, thankfully, it doesn't look like it's getting a hybrid, so... Uh, whew, or at least another, you know, a next level above Apex, which would be crazy. Um, so, uh, David's saying, to all the beaver babies around watching, send a big hello there. Hello there. Um, so I'll put up also the, the type of uh, stratagem, or the, uh, the raid that we're doing. So it revolves around having... Uh, three level 26 plus refs um, and this is gonna be a three round three turn sort of a shtick um, so I should have a level 26 I have a level 28 even ho 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 gonna, oh here we go we got um we got a flex of a level 30 raptor there oh well done <laughs> okay here we are at the Impertusuchus boss will it be an easy one? Or will it be a hard one? Will we get it first time? Oh, I don't know. I'd be very surprised. Ah! <laughs> All right, okay. I'm number three. So I go for... I mean, it's all distract, right? I'm wondering what, in fact, Imperator Suchus has <clears throat> in terms of, like, resistances. Uh, I, yeah, because everything's... Oh, 75% chance. So we're all going to go for the... Oh, no, me and two and three are the same. Ooh. Ooh. Right. So this all relies on no one running out of battery and or disconnecting and everyone following the stratagems. Mm. Okay. So I don't know what this does. I'm assuming it gives ferocious... Uh, oh, it's invincible. Oh, okay, okay. So the only one we need to worry about here is not hitting the Majungasaurus. However, we've all hit the Majungasaurus. Okay, oh, it's also bleed. Oh, oh my god. This is going to be a long one. How many things came up there? Jesus. So we're going to hit by that. And I think I'm also going to be hit by the Majungasaurus as well. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, thank god we're getting a heal. Oh, thank god. Oh, this looks awesome though. This is great. Three, three reps against a, a what looks like an albino. Uh, killer croc, but geez, this is gonna be long. Like, look at this. This animation of like four or f six probably things per turn happening. Damn. Wait, have they got health boosted uh, refs? Why did mine, like, oh, yeah, wait, oh, okay, right, two are the same. That guy mustn't have hit uh, the, uh, the, whatchamacallit, the croc, or if he did hit the croc. Ooh, we do zero damage, of course. Right, so the crocodile at the moment, I think, has three attack nullifiers. Now four attack nullifiers. No crit chance. Is bleeding and has also had his attack removed, I think. I think that's what that does, that regular bite. But anyway, here we go. Ooh, look, I can do a love kissy mamas. <laughs> mm. Yeah, so Majung does nothing now. Now, this is where we stray a little bit different. So, I go for the big one. And then, they sort of do a mixture between uh, the nullifying and the instant, like, hit everything with a distraction. So, hopefully, all of these minions do nothing. Because they've been completely, nu completely nullified. Um, so, yes, they've lost all their attack boosts. And they've also reduced damage. And we didn't hit them. So, that means that the crocodile also doesn't give them any extra right is this good at the highest attack now, i'm assuming that's probably the crocodile because it does boost its own attack when it fights back okay so that guarantees 
that we hit it first. And now it's doing nothing. How many attacks does it have on it? 12 plus 12 more. Hold on. Hold on. Look at this nonsense. 2.5 damage. 12.5 damage. Wow. Yeah, that's a lot. It doesn't... Okay. Okay, a little bit slower. Is that, that's going to hit everybody. Ooh. I guess also at the same time, there's no chance of this really going wrong. And now he's going to get... It. <laughs> <laughs> and then everyone puts nullifiers on him. What's he on? 13 more. Oh my god. And then I'm gonna do a hit here. And that's oh wow. Okay. Okay, this is this is kind of hilarious. <laughs> Even though it has like 75% chance to be resistant, or it is resistant, I should say. Uh to attack. Um it's interesting. Okay, so here we go. So now will it do oh. Uh oh. Is that good? Or is that bad? <gasps> oh, Ooh, it's good. It's good. It's good. We give the bumpy love hearts. We give the boat so we get loads of health. Oh, I need more health. Okay, next one's a... Even then, though, I don't think it's quicker. So how many does it have on him? It has 13 going. So I've got to go for this. And if I remember right, this means that I don't actually hit the Imperator Suchus or whatever it's called. And I just nullify it. I get rid of all its boosts. And I also just make sure that they don't have any attack. Ooh. It's fun, though. This is interesting. I like it. Right. Mm. Nullifies you. Okay, but yeah, I don't even know how much you've got. Only only three on you. That's interesting. I guess because we've all... we've focused on the crocodile and the crocodiles hit everything so it's also had our counters off <gasps> was that on me <gasps> i think it was why did you choose me you bugger you <laughs> is it because i'm level 28 how dare you how dare you pick me there's three other ones <laughs> you're spitting its face like Bleh. oh 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 it's doing some damage now oh so it's some damage Increases its attack. I think we get rid of it when we attack. No, we just reduce it. And take away its critical chance. Ah, no, never mind. And there's the reduction of that as well. Uh, and that hasn't killed it. But hopefully this will. Ooh, I mean, it says in the strategy that we need level 25 plus para. But we got level 27. Oh, no. Oh, he should have probably died. Oh, that. That. Oh, that didn't kill him. Oh god, we gotta go off script. Oh no! Uh, what? Nullify their positive effects. Yeah, pretty much. But I'm gonna have to attack it. Um, I mean, what am I doing next? Next, I'm going for that one. So I think I've just gotta go for just a regular. It makes no difference. I mean, I've only got three options. Two of them are basically the same, and one does more damage. Um, but I. Yeah, yeah, this... Oh, he's on low health now. What does this mean? How much damage does it do? Oh, it doesn't do anything. But it's also invincible. How long is it invincible for, though? Because I, I think maybe the bleed might kill it? Oh, God. Oh. Okay, okay. How much damage? Oh, we've all survived. We've all survived. Oh, my God. Okay, maybe it's going to be four per... Four per round? Why can't we just have something as nice as Morden Rex was? Morden Rex was lovely. I love Morden Rex. It was like two two rounds. That was it. It was nice. It was it was chill. It was it was just a good time. This one, however, no. Okay, so how how many hits is it going to take before its invincibility is gone? Is it four attacks? It's probably going to be four attacks. So we got to hope, hope. That, uh, I mean, we're gonna need Parasaurops. We're gonna need Parasaurops to go for its heal next turn. We're gonna need to. And here comes reduced damage. It's got the invincibility. Um, we're completely nullifying all its attacks for next turn because it went first. Um, so it's gonna have so many. It's gonna do, yeah, no damage. We need a heal. Now we need a heal. Um, I don't know what the cooldown is for it, though. Um, we need a heal. We need a heal for my uh, para. Uh, uh, time to heal. I mean, I, 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 we gotta surrender. I think if we heal, what's his cooldown on his other heal? It's cooldown two. I think, I think we're, I think we're okay. 
I honestly think we're okay here. I wanted to stick this out and see if we can. Ah. I mean, he's not going to be able to do his healy this, like, next turn. But this should just, like, get everybody. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. And again, I don't know what the cooldown is for that. It might be good, might be bad. What does this do? Yeah, we're going to... Oh dear. Oh dear. I don't know. We're, we're slowed as well, bear in mind. <laughs> oh, and I'm still going to do my attack. I don't know. But yes, we reduce him now. Everything's reduced. But I think even though everything's reduced, he's still going to be able to kill us because he's going to end up having the, um, the, the increased attack on him. Surrender. So somebody just said no instantly. <laughs> and he said no. What? Okay, let's just go. Oh, no. I don't know. I don't think we can do it. It depends. What does he do? What does he do turn two? Okay. Okay, that's that's okay. I, I don't... Th I think we might be good. If one of us had died there, that could have been it. Um, in fact, it might be. It might be it. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, it's it's over. It's over. Yeah. Because next turn, the Parasaurops hasn't went for its Healy. And because of that, we're all going to be hit by 700. And I'm dead. I'm dead next turn. Oh, well, well, there you go. First round. After, you know, first time we tried it. It could be worse. Could be worse, but at least we got through this round two. Ooh. Okay, we've done it. We've got through. Round one, and everything's okay. I am no longer the third one. And I don't know if that... I mean, obviously, it's made some sort of difference because we're alive. And I've been recording now for over half an hour. Yay! So, I am now moved to the first ref. Um, and I'm, I'm wondering if it's something to do with me being level 28 and not level 26 like the rest of them. Uh, maybe I do more damage and that like that's the thing when it comes to these Sorts of raids like even the tiniest bit of difference and that's it. It's like yep can't do it because this has happened um, I don't know. It's, it's interesting when it, it, it when it comes to raids because I Don't know if they could do like I mean that they've tried different things with apex DNA And that's what I'm trying to get at is like how can you implement DNA of creatures that are so sought after and so hard to get and so OP in some regards um, and sort of, you know, make it fair for everyone. Um, they could release them as infusers. Uh, however, you know, people like myself don't have those uh, dinosaurs because, you know, I don't have the DNA, so I can't make them. Whereas other people have already maxed up to level 30 and boosted and what have you. Um, and I think that's just something that the problem that the game has, and that is this whole, like, reward system. So everyone who is good in the game at the moment, or, you know, who finishes top in tournaments, who has a really, really active alliance, and they all contribute, um, you end up with really, like, polar opposites. You have, and I, I, I'm pretty sure if I, I don't have statistics on me, but... I would assume that's how it looks to Ludia as well. You have like a group of people that are like super, like play the game all the time and get the best rewards and stuff. And then you just have like everyone else who's like really slow to progress, doesn't have a very active alliance and eh, it's kind of like, I don't know. It, it's obviously like not the best system they can do because the people who are in that section don't get the chance to, to do raids like this. And they will never have the opportunity without communicating, without, you know, going on Discord and all that just Because you try, you cannot communicate this kind of raid in-game. What, what, what can I do? Like, I, we, I chat in here and say, heal, group shield. Nice, debuff them. That's another fun. Like, there's only so many different things that I can put on it without it, you know, then being... Cryptic, and maybe if I say a mistake, what's stopping me from you know accidentally clicking the wrong one, and it gets lost in translation. And maybe you can communicate outside of the battle with alliances and stuff like that, where you can actually type. <coughs> but then you're just kind of like 
you have to play with your alliance members. So the whole game relies on either you, uh, you know, communicating with people in a Facebook group or, or uh, you know, some sort of social media uh, site like Discord or something like that. Uh, so you cannot get the most out of this game, and maybe that's true for most games, uh, you can't get the most out of it in the actual game itself, uh, communications wise. Um, and I don't really know if there's a way for them to fix that. Ooh, a tail hit! We haven't seen that one before. Please don't kill me. Oh, good. Thank you. Ooh. But this is good, because we've made it to round two and turn six, and we've done it, I think. So we got three big hits. I'm pretty sure, like, two of them will be, like, yeah, 2,000, or 3,400, or 3,514, is it? It, whoa, uh, 3,500 and, uh, oh god, um, uh, 28, <laughs> something like that, but he's probably got armor. Sorry, I just, when I, I get a number in my head, I have to, I have to solve it, we have to. So we, we're approaching the final hurdle, oh, we're gonna do it. So, and another thing is, I, I don't mind like the randomness, oh you get a 10, you get a 20, oh you got a 50, you know, the DNA incubators and stuff like that, infusing as well, that's fine. Um, but I, the model for Jurassic World Alive, the way it goes is, it, it's interesting because it's sort of, it, it, you get like metas that appear, like dinosaurs that are really good, and then before you know it, that dinosaur's nerfed. And it's a bit of a shame because it's happened so many times now that with this game, you, c you can never feel confident, you know, putting boosts on creatures. And I know I probably sound like a broken record at this point, let's be honest. Um, but it's true and it's still, pre it's still prevalent, you know, throughout the game and, and how it is. I'm, I'm, and I do try and think of ways that they could sort of fix that because if, if you didn't nerf creatures, why, why not just add new creatures that can counter those creatures? And therefore, you haven't made... There's no feels baddy, you know, like on people. Like, that feels bad. Like, oh, well, great. I, I, I can't lose this creature that I made because Ludio went, no, you can't use that. Instead of why not just making a new creature that completely counters that one. And that way... It's not like it feels bad on the player, it's just that's the way the game is. There's a new thing out and you've got to be aware of it. And then maybe another creature will be used to take out that one, you know, that wasn't used before. Instead of this almost fixing of the, the you know, the, the meta, as it were. It's like, did you go, oh, balance, yep, that's nerfed, this is increasing all this jazz. I don't know, I mean, maybe they thought about that, but it, even since the start, with Velociraptor, if anyone remembers when this game first came out, Velociraptor was used so much. It was so OP because it was faster, it could pounce, and then you could switch it out. And then just repeat when the next thing died, and you were good. Um, so then they ended in, they made, you know, the superiority strike, which cleansed your damage reduction, and then sped reduced them. And that completely changed the game. And from there on out, I think, you know, the creators of the game were like, this is how we do it now. If something's overpowered, remove its power, and then just no one uses it anymore. <laughs> and that way, people will have to spend more, you know, in-game currency to level up a different creature. And, and therefore, they'll keep on playing. Oh my god, that was tough. Ooh, 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 that was tough. We have one more. We're on turn eight. Or I should say round eight. And wow. Wow. Oh, but good news is I think I'm going to reduce the attack increase that the Kool-Aid's got there. The, the Kool-Aid Sutures. And hopefully maybe even stun it. Um, oh, kill it even. <laughs> I'm not dead as well. I'm actually... Oh, God. We don't have a cleanse. <gasps> Do we? Oh, we do. Oh, oh, thank goodness. Oh, that was close. And we've all survived as long as it doesn't get a crit, which it won't get a crit because I think it's been completely reduced. Oh, this, this is the closest I've ever seen. It could so easily go. Like we all get bleed, dead. Like everyone, if we didn't cleanse ourselves or whatever, didn't get that heal, pretty much everyone would be dead at this point. 
Whoa. And then the last one, three of us go for attacks and then one nullifies. Oh, damn. Oh, no, 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 no. That's it. I think we're okay, though. I think, I think we're good. Hopefully. Yes, that was the one that attacked. That's fine. He was only going to do some sort of nullifying. 5,000. Okay, here we go. We got this. We got this bloke. He's easy. No lies. Ooh. Yep, just every... Okay, he's going to go for the one with the lowest HP. So somebody's dead, right? I think. Woo! Woo! <laughs> okay, it was a hit everybody. That must be its revenge. Its revenge profile is it hits everybody. Oh! Oh my god! This was... This is not going to be an easy raid. Wow, I think we've done it though. Pretty much as soon as one hits, they die. And then the next one hits, it dies. But that's fine, because I think we've killed it. Yep, yep, it's my turn to die. I'm sorry. I couldn't handle it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, two dead. And then this guy, if it didn't kill him now, it would die. I think it does 2,400, so we should be all right. And boom, got the crit. And there it is. Oh, <gasps> oh my god that was tough so i mean first time we've ever done this and that took 45 minutes good god and we i mean we got lucky i think um but then again did we because i mean luck's not part of it because we reduced its crit chance to zero and there it is it looks like a decapitated crocodile head sweet i, I kind of want to know what this guy's like now. You know, if, if we manage to unlock it, is it any good? So how many did we get? We got a 15. That's actually not so bad. A 15, like a 10 feels bad. A 15's like, eh. I think 15 has the highest chance of, like, you getting it. And 10's quite low. 20 is, like, not as low as 10. Because they, I think Ludia knows that you give somebody a 10, it's like... Middle finger, isn't it? <laughs> well, anyway, guys. Uh, I want to say a quick thank you to uh, your chance there. Uh, I want to give a thank you to uh, Pro C and as well as David for uh, just making that as speedy as possible so we can get the god that up for you as quickly as possible. And of course, thank you, you guys, for tuning in. Uh, I mean, if I, I'm pretty sure this update has updated a load of uh, different dinosaurs as well, so we definitely need to check those out and just see what the change is or what the changes are because I think they may have already been uh, affected by it. Uh, I'll have a quick check to see if my... Because uh, I know the bird is getting a change. Oh, interesting. So I don't... That is my PvP team, yes. Wait, it doesn't show you how much you need anymore? <gasps> Ooh, well, that's a, that's a little bit of a change now, isn't it? But, um... Yep, you've, you don't have your swap in rend, but I think that was already taken out anyway. But anyway, guys, I'm not going to hold you for any more time because you've got stuff to do and I've, I've got sleep because now it's uh, it's almost four in the, four, four in the morning. <laughs> but if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.